The ice is thick and packed with history out on the Lebanon Green. You got a skating rink that the town has been doing now for well over 50 years. With a snowy start to February, snow blanketed the ice. The initial snowfall was a little one. Um, and it didn't get cleared off, so the, the ice itself got very lumpy. Um, it was really difficult for people to skate on. Help from the community in over 10,000 gallons of water later, Fire Chief Jay Skull, along with the Lebanon Volunteer Fire Department, got it back into working order. It was a lot of effort. A lot of people put in the time to get it cleared. Most of the times we're responding to medical calls, car accidents, fires, and, you know, we're interacting with the community on some of their worst days. So anytime we can participate in something that will help out, help people out, we're gonna do it. It's been uh, so wonderful. The other night when we saw the fire trucks out here, we thought, what's going on? And then they were out here for several hours, and it was amazing, and it's just that sense of community. But the Sunday snowstorm once again laid down another layer of fluffy powder. <laughs> Oh, oh, no, not the cameraman. <laughs> but that didn't stop families from enjoying the area Monday. I'm trying to clear up the snow so I can ice skate. <laughs> With eyes on more snow forecasted for Tuesday, the plan here, to clear it again, eventually. The fact that we had already done it once and, you know, it was widely popular amongst folks that we did it, I think, uh, I don't think we would have any problem here in this community getting another group of people out here to clean it off. Whoa! <laughs> it's been such a pleasure. I mean, all things considered, it's been a pleasure for all of us to be out here. With more snow on the way for Tuesday, they're going to need the community's help to get this cleaned up once again. In Lebanon, I'm Rachel Piscatelli, Fox 61 News.